Hello and welcome to another Teacher's Corner playthrough. I'm Teacher Kirby and this is, we're going to replay All That Glitters. I'm replaying because there were audio issues on the original playthrough. So we're going to replay. Are you familiar with Voyager's emergency medical hologram? He's quite unique, even for an old EMH Mark I. Now he holds rank in Starfleet in his own right. We've received a message that the doctor requires assistance to deal with a medical situation on an Ocampa freighter in the Shenda system. He's currently en route in one of Voyager's shuttles. Normally I'd send a medical vessel, but we've seen a spike in Vadois attacks, and I want to make sure he has all the resources he'll need. Could you go to the Shenda system and assist the doctor? So we travel to the Shenda system, which is located in the Delta Quadrant, to meet the doctor. Okay, and we'll get a reduced amount of rewards. Normally the current lockbox on your first playthrough is not available as a reward. So you just have the Mark 12 career specific kit reward available. And now let's make this our primary mission. Just so that it's put in yellow and we'll transwarp there. Here we go. We're going to begin All That Glitters. We have arrived in the Shenda system, Captain. The distress signal is coming from the transport dead ahead, but we've received no response to our hails. I'll keep trying, but perhaps our guest knows more. The emergency medical hologram, known as the Doctor, is in a nearby shuttle and waiting and awaiting our hail. Take us to the Doctor's shuttle. Hail the Doctor's shuttle. Pleased to meet you. I scanned your service record before your arrival. You've been in quite a few battles, haven't you? Ever stop to think about the strain you're putting on your medical crew before you charge into combat? Of course you don't. No captain ever does. Nice to meet you too, Doctor. We've been hailing this Ocampan freighter for some time, but we're not getting a response, and our sensors cannot penetrate their shields. Their initial distress signals indicated that they were suffering from Paranisti measles. I can treat it easily, if I can get onto the ship. Now that your ship is here, it should be trivial to board the vessel and assess the situation. Transport me aboard your vessel, and then my shuttle can return to Voyager. Prepare for transport. Transport the doctor to your ship. So we're transporting him. Excellent. Your ship has more powerful sensors than my shuttle. So we scanned the disabled ship. It was actually, um, actually got a chance to interview Bob Picardo at STLV 50. And he said that it was quite nice to come back and do and play the doctor again for STO. He enjoyed it quite a bit. Oh. Fod worship. Here we go. Hold your fire. I am Gaul, leader of the Vadwa. Ooh, Gaul. Now what did we do to earn this pleasure? Let's hail the lead ship. Greetings. I am Gaul, leader of the Vadwa Supremacy. I apologize for the overzealousness of my soldiers. This action was not authorized. I am Admiral Sirhan of the Teacher's Corner. I'm pleased to finally meet you. It appears your presence here in the Delta Quadrant has inadvertently caused some conflict between us. I would rather avoid any more unpleasantness. Would you be willing to meet with me face to face? Yes, but I found such talks are best on 
neutral ground. That is understandable. You have a location in mind? There are not many areas of the Delta Quadrant where my people are not reviled. I might know a place. I will be back with you in a moment. So we're going to oh, hail Neelix. What a wonderful surprise! Is there anything I can do for you? Hello, Neelix. We need a neutral place for a diplomatic negotiation with the Vaudoir. And I was wondering if you could help. Diplomatic negotiations? I am Starfleet's ambassador to the Delta Quadrant. I would be more than happy to offer my services as mediator. As for the location, Dexa and most of our people are on new Talax now. But we still have the asteroid base in the Antaba system. It's mostly empty now, just a few cleanup crews. And the Kazon have been leaving it alone. It would be perfect. Thank you. Your assistance is greatly appreciated. Now we hail Gaul again. Well, did you find a suitable location for our meeting? There's an asteroid base in the Antaba system that the Talaxians have been using. Talaxians? Are there still Talaxian communities? How odd. The site is agreeable. Send my ship the coordinates and I will meet you there. Coordinates set. We'll talk there. I'm contacting the closest medical ship. They can investigate this further while we meet with Gaul. Excellent idea, Doctor. We can set course for the Intaba system as soon as you're ready, sir. Warp to the Intaba system. So yes, I'm ready. Sir, we have arrived in the Intaba system. Gaul's ship is already here and he has transported down to the base. So we continue. And we're going to move forward Imagine to the base. Using a medical emergency as a trap. The Vaudoir have no shame. I don't trust Gaul. He betrayed it's us good on to see you again, sir. He'll do it again. If I might make a suggestion. I would recommend only bringing two crew members with your away team. Gaul brought four aides. You'll have the doctor and myself, and bringing more of your crew down might look like you're trying to get an advantage on him. Gaul seems very touchy. Proper protocol will be important. Are you ready to beam down? Beam down. And I'm only bringing two of my crew. It's so good to see... Doctor, it's been 30 years! You haven't aged a day! Yes. It's good to see you too, Neelix. We have a bit of time before we'll begin. We're giving the Vaudoir a fine Talaxian feast to help ease the tension. Doctor, you must tell me all you've been up to. Oh, Neelix, I couldn't. Not with the Vaudoir here. But I suppose it is important that you hear about my many achievements since our last meeting. And my brilliant research was able to prove conclusively. Thus I began my grand adventure into the challenge of writing Klingon opera. Oh, well, Brax and I agreed to never mention the incident again. <laughs> well, at least not to Dexa. <laughs> Neelix, the Vardwar have finished the appetizers and are waiting for you. Oh, well, we had... Better get going. W we can talk more later. About time. That takes forever. The Doctor and Neelix can really talk. Do you remember Chef Jolax from the last time you were here? He's the one that has been serving the Vaudoir, their fabulous appetizers. Full bellies make for good conversation, I always say. He told me that Gaul is a little grumpy, but I'm sure you can handle him. Gaul is in the command room now, waiting for us. Jolax should be back soon to take everyone's orders for the main course. Thank you, Neelix. Let's go speak with Gaul. And so we can... We can move ahead. Since we don't have to follow him. And this way... Through here... To the other side... 
past the group of Talaxians nonchalantly speaking and use the turbo lift. And see, they come with us. And now we talk to Gaul. Ah, at last. I must say, your Talaxian friends are quite hospitable. But down to business. Our meeting is long overdue. Indeed. It's time to settle our differences. As do I. My people are damaged, in crisis. We are already at war with the Kabali, and with you, given your alliance's support for them. Let us try to find an accord that benefits us both. Do you know why we fight the Kabali? Their world was once a Vadwa colony, one of our largest. And there is still a large cache of stasis tubes on the planet. Those are my brothers and sisters being held hostage. The Kabali are stealing them, taking their very identities and transforming them. They won't return the remaining tubes? The Kabali would rather watch us die and use our corpses as fuel for their unnatural corruption. Is it wrong to fight against your own extinction? Don't we have a right to survive as well? There must be a way we can end this peacefully. This war will scar the Quadrant for decades to come. There can be no peace. Not after what they've done. Are you suggesting we are weak? That we should just lay down and die for them? No. We will not. No, but destroying the Kabali isn't right either. There are greater threats in the galaxy we must face. Do not try to pacify me. We will have our retribution. You have my offer. Abandon your alliance with the Kobali and support us, and we will be your strongest ally in the Quadrant. I'm not here to start a war with the Kobali. <laughs> Peace. You know nothing of what it means to be Vadwar. You need to understand. What do you mean? The Vodwar have endured too much to make peace. Do you expect us to forget the destruction of our cities? The massacres of our people? The food's almost ready. What would you all like for your main course? You need to understand even the smallest fraction of our anger. <gasps> no. He's dead. I'm sorry. <laughs> Does that make you angry, Talaxian? No. It makes me sad. For Jolex. And for you. Then we are not done. <laughs> what the? Huh? Oh no. Oh no. What have they done? That's a pretty long pause there. Okay, contact our ship. Admiral, the entire Vodwar fleet is opening fire on the remaining Talaxians' ships. We sent out distress signals to every ship in range. We'll do what we can to protect the Talaxians, but we can't hold out against this many ships. What happened? So explain the situation. That's horrible. Do you think Gaul had any intention of negotiating good faith? Or was this all an act? We're giving the Talaxians all the time we can to escape, but it's not looking good up here, sir. Some of the Vaudoir have already broken off to pursue them. Your orders? So, we can ask for a tactical strike team, but as you'll see, we'd have to drop shields to transport or launch a shuttle, sir. If I do that, I'll lose the ship. We'll try to find some way to get help to you. But until things are under control up here, we do, then anything we do is going to be risky. And he scanned the base. How many Talaxians are still alive? Scans showed two large groups of Talaxians in a storage room and the logistics area. They have the doors blocked, but there are Vaudoir trying to get in both locations. It doesn't look good, Captain. I'm afraid you will only have time to rescue one group. Good luck, sir. 
Do your best to save the Talaxians no matter what. Starfleet will not let more innocents die today. And now we have to speak to the doctor. Time only to save one group? I do not envy your choice. I would go with you, but I cannot leave Neelix alone. And time is of the essence. I'm afraid you'll have to go on without us. Very well. Make sure to get Neelix. No. I'm going. I can't sit by and let the Bard War kill my friends. I, I won't be a burden. I promise. I have to do this. Stay close to me, Neelix, and I'll ensure your safety. Alright, so now we have to defeat Vaudoir in the cargo bay. Which means we go this way. And we have to use turbo lift and... one group there's another group We're fighting them fighting 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 here we go how do we choose who to save all right now we have to choose it really, in the end, it does not matter which group you choose. So, since I'm closer, I'm going to go here. Save to laxins in the storage. As I said, it really does not matter which group you choose. We've saved the hostages, but they may be safer here. Tell hostages to stay here until the base is clear. What about the people so in the that? Okay. Now we have to go to logistic. And as I said, it really does not matter which group you choose. The first group you're going to be able to save, the second group is going to be dead. You're still going to have to fight the Vaudoir. And we have to talk to check them. for civilians, for friends. life. They are beyond my help now, Neelix. I'm sorry. Alright, and now... Then we can still save the others. We have to get to the shuttle in the cargo bay. Open the blast door. So we come out here. Always love to hear PMs like that. So I'm going to respond very quickly and then we continue. Okay. And we're going to defeat the Vaudoir.
and kill all the Vodwar. I've sent a signal to the remaining Talaxians to join us here as soon as possible. And the remaining Talaxians are going to arrive. And here's what I'm going to do. More Vodwar on the way. Because I know Vodwar are going to come here. I'm going to set my two engineers up there. And I'm gonna have them more on the way. If I were to hologram, out their I'd be worried. If I weren't a hologram, I'd be worried. I love that. A large number of Vodwar are closing in. I'm afraid they may be too much for you to handle. And we're gonna have our guys sit up there. After Mine. this, our debt to you is repaid. And the Tere have arrived. That's timely. Here come the Bodwar. Here they come. And again, my guys are up there. They're taking. We're gonna keep those mines laid out for the Vodwar so that they get blown up as much as possible. Hey, been yeah, that was fast. With you before you continue. All right, let's release our guys. There we go. And where is our top guy? There he is. There's our top terrain. Our help does not mean we are now allies. We are repaying a debt. Our ships are currently engaging the Vaudois fleet. It is unsafe for this shuttle to launch until they are defeated. We will return to our ships. I suggest you do the same. We will provide cover for your ship so it may drop shields to transport you. We appreciate the help. Alright, the teacher's corner is ready to transport us, Admiral. So we leave the Talaxian base. And now we need to provide cover so that the shuttle can go. Here we go. I knew this meeting was a farce. The word Vodwar means fool in ancient Talaxian. Did you know that? You thought me a fool who would swallow your insults without comment. A fool who would blunder into the trap you set with the Torey. I am not. You're the one who did this, Gaul, not me. This has destroyed any chance of an accord between us. How disappointing. I had thought you would be a valuable ally. Now you are just another victim. We did everything we could to make peace with you, Gaul. You're the one who destroyed it. And here we go. I always like to buff up. Hate when we power slide past. There we go. Voyager is here. They will not allow the bond to escape. There we go. Let's go ahead and pull out our fleet support. Into the fray once more. Remember, we have energy refrequencer. The more damage we do, the more we heal. So if we can be hitting multiple targets, all the better. There we go. Let's see. Are there any more? Nope, don't seem to be. You came to our aid when the Vaudoir attacked our home world. Now we have come to assist you. This discharges our obligation. Thank you for your assistance. Perhaps we can be allies someday. 
could they do something so horrible? We're no threat to them. We've done nothing but welcome them. And he just... He killed my friends just to make a statement. I... I don't understand how anyone would be so callous. I'm so sorry, Neelix. I don't blame you. I agreed to let the Vaudoir come here. I put my people in danger. This is my responsibility. I just never conceived that even the Vaudoir could be so treacherous. They double-crossed us on Voyager and tried to take the ship, but slaughtering innocent people. My time on Voyager changed me. I saw the best that people could be. I forgot, or wanted to forget, how evil they could be. Neelix, I promise you that Gull will face justice for what he's done. With your permission, I'll lead the survivors back to New Talix. Then we can return with a security force to collect the dead. Farewell, Neelix. I've been in contact with the USS Blackwell. They boarded the freighter in the Shenda system, but it was empty. It was all a ruse by the Vaudoir to lure us into that system. Everything was part of this play Gaul wanted to perform, from the initial distress call to his intervention and offer to negotiate. And then he used a massacre to set his stage. That's the kind of man he is, and unless he stopped, the entire quadrant may fall. Let us hope it does not come to that, Doctor. Gaul has shown his true nature. I expected he was not dealing in good faith. But nevertheless, we had to make an attempt to find a peaceful solution to our problems with the Vaudoir. Now the war will continue. I grieve for all who have been lost, and for those who will fall before this conflict ends. We had to try, Admiral. Senseless, meaningless death. I'll never understand. I hope Neelix and his people will be able to find some peace, and that Gaul will answer for his crimes. And I hope our paths cross again, perhaps under better circumstances next time. With your permission, I'll return to Voyager. Permission granted. Farewell, Doctor. It has been an honor. The Talaxian base is safe for now, and the surviving Talaxians are making their way to new Talax. Shall we depart? Depart system. So we leave. And that finishes the episode All That Glitter. Alright, so that finishes the episode All That Glitters. We'll turn it in. Gaul's actions were unconscionable. A senseless slaughter simply to make a point? And he wanted your sympathy? It's clear from your reports that he had no intention of making peace, and that he would have twisted anything you said to meet his own agenda. He's a warmonger, and one that must be stopped. Peace with the Vaudoir will not be attended or attained through Gaul. But we'll keep looking for other for another way. Perhaps there's someone out there who will be more reasonable. And of course we get a smaller amount of XP and experience. And I'm going to choose the career specific reward. Maybe we'll get something new. K perf times two. Nice. That's a nice kit. Alright. And is Mark 13. Alright, so join me next time for the patrol mission wrapper. Know your enemies. See you then.